Sherry Schmidt going live here from my office in Wisconsin. And today I want to talk to you um, about setting goals. You know, we have a new month coming up. And instead of making a list, what I want you guys to do is, well, see my schedule here, my calendar over here. I also have a calendar here, but then I also have my um, little calendar that I can write on a daily, um, on writing it daily, right? what we want to do, what we need to do. I think it's very important, you know. Um, I always thought a to-do list was a good thing. But then when you think about it, what really is it to, to what is a to-do list? It's something I want to do? No, we need to write down something. Let's say, okay, every day I'm going to take out my little, um, book here come Jan come February you know that tomorrow's the last day of January 2018 and it's going to be gone forever right yep so what I'm going to do let's see here February I'm going to say February 1st I'm just going to write down jot down what my schedule is going to look like when I get up in the morning what I'm going to do, um, just so easy, right? If um, Just get these things on your calendar. I believe that's the important part. Don't you agree? You know, if you put it, just put it on a list, like, what the hell? What the heck? You need to get this stuff written down on your calendar, guys. What do you want to do every day? Do you want to go live? I think it's very important that if you get it down, you get it written down, scheduled on your calendar, that you're more likely to follow through with it. Wouldn't you agree? Hi, doll. How are you today, honey? So, what do you think, guys? Do you think the new month, new goals, what are we going to do with that? Are we going to, um, yeah, give me some love. So instead of making a long list of what we're going to do, what I want you guys to do is take out your calendar and schedule it. Doesn't get easier than that, does it? Hmm. What do I want to do on February 1st? February 1st. Coming up, coming up, see, tomorrow's the 31st, and then we have a new month coming on. New month, new goals. Chances are that if you schedule it, it's going to get done. Yeah, not just a calendar. Get yourself one of these, Dolly. Get yourself a planner. Plan. Schedule. Do. If you don't, I'm finding out, you know, I have my to-do list. Look. Yep, I got them right here. Write them down every day. Here's my to-do list. You know, I got to make my Facebook post. I got to go over to LinkedIn. I got to do Twitter. Twitter. I got to contact these people. You know, don't make a list. What you need to do Instead of making those long lists with all your goals on it from now on, what you're going to do is you're going to take out your calendar and you're going to schedule it. Okay? Tomorrow, what are you going to do? You're going to take out your calendar and you're going to schedule. Hello, Pamela. Today I'm talking about goals. You like making goals? It's a new month. And, um, yeah, we're not going to set, we're not going to make a big old long list of goals anymore. No. What we're going to do it was we're going to get rid of those long lists. Those lists, woo, we're going to throw them away. What I want to talk to you guys about, this is very important. We're going to grab your calendar and you're going to schedule it. 
schedule what you want to get done. Okay? Another important thing is why you want to do this. Think about that. Why do you do what you do every day? Why? Me? My why? Oh, two little boys. Two little boys. Brayden and Elias, my grandbabies. No, I don't, um, you know, I raised my two sons. I had to work sometimes two, three, four. I was working all the time. You know what? I missed their, um, their whole childhood. And when my first grandson was born, I vowed never again, Sherry. You're, that's not going to happen. I'm done working so damn hard. You know, I'm 57 years old. Just turned 57. So what I am trying to do is find an easier way, a way that works. Believe me, I've tried these lists. Make a list. Decide what you need to do every day. Doesn't work. You know what I've found out does work? Scheduling everything thing in my calendar. Schedule it. I'm going to day number one coming up here on Thursday, February 1st. I'm making a vow of what I'm going to do. I'm going to schedule it. I'm not going to make no damn to-do list anymore. That's history. That's out the door. That's my old, my own mindset, my old mindset. Gone. History. From now on, what I'm going to do, I'm going to schedule it. I'm going to put it in my calendar, and I'm going to get it done. woo -hoo! Anybody with me there? Come on. What do you think? You look wonderful as well. Thank you so much, Beverly. I'm feeling pretty darn good, too. You know, um, my new business has built up my confidence. It makes me look. I just feel so good. I feel energized. I just, um, I think when you feel good about yourself and you actually can see the difference, yeah, I'm, I believe good things are going to happen to me and my team. So, um, you know, that's really all I wanted to bring up today, you know, um, setting those goals. It's a new month, guys and girls. <laughs> so let's get her done. Let's. Um, get this stuff in your calendar, okay? Um, I just want you all to have, enjoy a productive month ahead. Anybody with me? Thumbs up? Can I get a thumbs up? Yeah, I think that's um, absolutely, yeah. Yeah, it makes you feel better. It makes getting things done, taking action. Woohoo! I'm fired up, guys, and I'm ready. I'm going to get this stuff scheduled in my calendar. These to-do lists, whoop, whoop, no more to-do lists. Come the 1st of February, everything, everything is going to get scheduled. 2018 is going to rock out. All right, ladies, and I guess I might have... um a couple men on here yet, not sure. Anyways, I just want you guys all to have a productive month. Make um, 2018 our best year yet. Hello, Vicki. How are you today, honey? Um, today, I was just talking about the importance of um, getting rid of our to-do list. I just shredded mine all the pieces. No more to-do lists, okay? We are going to schedule everything. Get it in your calendar. No more to-do lists, okay? Say hi, Vicki. Give me some love. All right, anyways, um, I hope this has given you some ideas to help you follow through on your goals in February, okay? No more to-do lists, okay? Schedule everything. Get it in your calendar. Get yourself, whoops, get yourself a little book and get it done. All right, that's all I'm going to say. Send my peace. I love you all. Yes, hello and um, enjoy the productive month ahead, ladies. If anybody needs any help 
or any more ideas, shoot me over a message. I'm here to help each and every one of you reach your goals in 2018 and beyond. Mwah! Love you all. Bye.